Today's review is going to be on Website Mojo by Art Flair and Palab Gosal. I want to quickly show you the sales page and then I'm going to take you inside the software to show you how it works, okay? And we'll talk about the strategy behind this product as I'm walking you through the elements. I'll then show you the upsells, give you the pros and cons, and then my personal recommendation based on my years of experience working online. So stay with me, okay, because there's a major piece missing in the strategy that you need to know before you purchase this product. My name is Suzanne Stoddard, and let's get going. And I gather you're here because you're looking for a way to make money online, right? Have you made your first commission yet? Or are you struggling trying to put all the pieces together? If you click my link below, it'll take you to this page where you can quickly sign up. Click consent and the big blue button and you'll be taken to this page here. And for the price of a pizza, you will get extensive training on how to earn your first commission online using YouTube. And don't worry, you don't have to show your face. Not only is the training extensive, but it comes with 50 done for you niche ideas and express setup. And you'll see that this is the simplest way to generate passive traffic and consistent recurring income. So go ahead, click my link. You'll be so glad you did. But let's get back to the sales page. He says that you can create and sell unlimited websites and funnels with one click. That this is the first chat GPT powered app. You can create websites and funnels in 30 seconds and includes a thousand inbuilt ready to use templates. Well, I hate to say this guys, but this is extremely exaggerated. My goodness. For one thing, they're jumping on the chat GPT bandwagon right now, saying that everything is integrated with this, which there is no proof of. It'll take you much more than 30 seconds to develop a website or funnel. There certainly isn't a thousand built-in templates. And then they talk about free and autopilot traffic, which I saw no evidence of. So this sales page so far has quite a bit of hype and lies. And when they come down here and they say that getting this tool will save you the cost of getting any of these other type of page builders. Well, there's a reason why these other page builders cost money because they've been around a long time. They're reputable and you don't have to worry about them closing down anytime soon. Whereas when it comes to a product like this that you get for a one-time cost, there's no way to know how long this product will be online. Many vendors, when they can't afford to upkeep them anymore, simply forget about them or take them down and then you lose everything. And you can certainly read through the rest of this page on your own. It's a typical shiny object sales page that tells you what you want to hear to try and convince you that this is going to be the answer to all of your money troubles. So let's go inside so I can show you what you get. This is the dashboard when you first sign in. Now this is a JV copy, okay? I couldn't get my own copy to show you because this isn't launched until Saturday, February 11th. Now the first thing you'd want to do is look at training and tutorials. But there's not much here, okay? There is one overview video that simply shows you all the different elements in the page builder very quickly. So if you are a beginner at this, you're probably going to struggle with this page builder. But let's take a look at what it is. If you click on website creator, you will have to sign in and this is what the page builder software looks like. So you would click on new project and you can either start with a blank page which certainly is not beginner friendly and you get these templates. Now remember when he said there were thousands of templates? Well there aren't. <laughs> there are 27 and if you come up here they are in different categories. You can get some that are just a landing page so it's a one page site or for a blog or a portfolio. So let's just choose one so I can show you what it looks like. Let's pick this one here and you give it a name. So I'll just call this demo site and click create. And it comes up in the page builder here. And I mean, this is pretty decent. There are a lot of options here. 
But as I said, if you've never used one before, there's going to be a bit of a learning curve to this. You can click on each individual element and change it to your heart's content. So let's say I wanted to change this to demo site, okay? And you can change any of the writing. So this is what that page is that we chose. And it's a very short one, okay? But in this page builder, you can add different containers to lengthen it and to add to make your page longer if you need to with additional information. And I'm not going to go through everything because that's not the purpose of this video, okay? I just wanted to give you an idea of what this page builder offered. There are different elements, like all the different components you can add, different layouts, media if you want to add an image or a video, the topography, buttons, there's a few choices, not too many, and your different forms, like for an opt-in form. Then there is the inspector. And this is basically where you're making sure that it would suit a desktop or a mobile, especially because everything is mobile now. You can change your background, add shadows, add padding, all that type of thing. And then you can add additional pages. If this were more of a website versus a single page, you could add additional pages to this. And then you have settings. And if you decided you didn't like this template and you wanted to change it, it brings up all the other templates that you saw before. So if you clicked on one, it says it would erase everything you've done and you're applying the new one. And you can go ahead and work on a new template if that's what you want. And then if you were planning on selling these templates, they do give you the HTML code for you to set it up for your client. Now, unfortunately, as I said, there's no training for this in there. So if you're a total beginner, you're going to be struggling to know even how to go about selling websites that you're possibly designing for a particular person. You can preview your template. So this is what it looks like outside of the editor. There's no export or an import. So this could very well be part of the upsells. You can see it in a different format, so you want to make sure that it looks good in a mobile setting, and you can save it. So that's just a quick overview of what the page builder is like, and everything you've created is saved here on this dashboard. They also have domain here, so this is how you would connect your own domain name to be able to sell these or use it for yourself. But keep in mind, even if you do this, this is still being hosted on his server, so you're at the mercy of him keeping this product up, okay? The other thing in here are the done for you mobile web templates. And again, there are only 20 in here. I had thought that maybe there were six in this particular one, but when you preview it, this one is for selling clothing items. There is only the one sample in here. So there are some for clothes, this would be for a restaurant if you wanted to create a little website for, let's say, a local restaurant. This is one that says we create unique websites, so that might be handy if you plan on using this as an agency. This one would be for pets. There seem to be three for pets, two for real estate. There's three for a doctor. Okay, and they do look very nice. Two for cars. And then there are three for agency, and they look like this. So depending on your needs. But as I said, again, if you're a total beginner, these are going to be very difficult to work with. First, you would have to download it, and then you would have to upload the zip file that you got into your page builder software. At least that's what I am assuming, because you can't edit it on your computer it has to be in some sort of page builder software. So let's say we open a blank page under mobile. I am assuming that you would be using this button here to upload it to this page builder so that you can edit it, but it's not allowing me to do that. And there's no training or instruction to use these templates. 
So there's definitely something missing there. Then there is the AI content writer. And this is actually just a little writer. Let's say you wanted to have it write something that you would use on one of your templates. So let's say you were creating a website for pet care. So I would enter these types of keywords and you hit save. So it pops up down here and you can view it. And it's decided to give it to us in four points, which isn't what I expected. But basically, this is the type of thing that it gives you. So you would have to do this several times until you come up with something that you like, or of course, rewrite it. And then you would go to whichever website you had created pertaining to pets. So let's say it's this one here. And on this page, you wanted this to say something more about your pet care website. You would just copy whatever the AI writer wrote and then paste it in here to replace what the template is saying. So that's what they show in their demo video of how you can use this AI writer. And none of the examples that they have here, let's take a look at this one, they're all very short. So this is really just to help you put something on your template that pertains to the topic of that template, okay? And on the sales page, they state that this is chat GPT approved content. Well, there's no such thing as chat GPT approved for one thing. And who's to say that they're connecting to chat GPT? This is just a simple little AI writer that a lot of shiny objects have integrated with. Do you also remember on the sales page, it said that there was free and autopilot traffic? Well, I'm sorry, there's absolutely nothing like that in here. No matter where you click, there's nothing about traffic whatsoever. And that is the big missing piece of this strategy. They don't have any training on how you can get traffic to any sites, nor is there training on how to become a freelancer and using sites like Fiverr.com or Upwork or anything like that to start selling any websites that you're creating. And that's the problem with these one-time cost shiny objects. They make it look really nice up front and try and convince you you'll make a lot of money with this. But realistically, they're the ones making all this money off of you. So be very careful here and hopefully you know what you're doing before you purchase this product. And now let me show you the upsells. Your front end product costs $16.93 and then there are six upsells. They all have their set price. I wasn't able to access the actual pages and I'm sure there will be a downsell price to each of these. There usually is. But be very careful here. As I said, unless you know what you're doing with a page builder, you're going to have a difficult time creating something that you can sell. Now, you can certainly make sites for yourself. But as I said, this is all hosted on their server. And really, you're at the mercy of how long they're going to keep the server running for your websites your businesses could disappear overnight. So what are the pros and cons of this product? Well, the pros are that it is a pretty decent looking page builder. So with practice, you could possibly create some nice looking websites, but the cons are that this has poor training. For one thing, it does not have any specific training on using that page builder. So as a total beginner, you're going to struggle. And there was no training at all on how to use those mobile templates for you to be able to edit and possibly sell. The next con is that it has a limited front end. And that's typical of all shiny objects. They break the software up so that you end up spending a whole lot more money to get unlimited, to get more done for you templates, things like that. And the third con is that there are no traffic sources. They claim there was going to be free traffic sources, but there was none in there. So my recommendation is no, you shouldn't buy this software. Not unless you really know what you're doing with a page builder. If you truly want to learn how to make money online quickly and easily, click my link below. Because for the price of a pizza, 
You can learn how to make your first commissions online with some excellent detailed training and many done-for-you resources. So thanks so much for watching my review today. If you enjoyed it, would you please subscribe to my channel? And if you have any questions or comments about this software, just leave them below and I'll get right back to you. So until next time, keep doing your research. Cheers.